Hi guys, welcome to Pago Paiva channel. In this video, we will show you how to extract the data in table format from website to Excel and make use of that data for data analysis. In this, we will show not only to extract the data as well as we show how to forecast using Excel. Before going ahead, I request you to subscribe to our channel for more such videos and click notification icon. So we will go ahead with the session now. I want to analyze, analyze USD to INR currency fluctuation over a period of one year using that data I want to forecast for the next one month. So in dot invest gives me the historical data of USD to INR on daily basis. So it is showing me the price. What is the open price? High, low, what was the volume traded? What is the percentage change in price? So we can get historical data. So I have fetch data of last one year, as I said earlier, from 23rd June, 2020 to 22nd June, 2021. So if we see once the data filter is applied, there is so many rows of data available in this page. So now it will be a big challenge for us to copy and paste to Excel. So instead of doing that, there is a very simple way, which is purely help you to fetch the data to Excel. Go to Excel, go to data tab, under data tab, you can find get data option. So under that, from other sources, click web. So if you click web, there will be a pop-up box, which will be asking for URL. So you have to mention the URL of the page where the table is available currently. I'm just copying the URL. Now I'm going back to Excel and I'm mentioning the URL of the website here and click OK. So now Excel will connect to investing.com and fetch the table data. Please remember your internet connection should be in a better way so that Excel can connect to the website and fetch the data properly. So it will take a little bit of time. It would be definitely depends on your internet speed. So there would be different document tables and everything will be there. In table one is the data which is required by us for analysis. Basically. So in table two, these and all are not required. Table three, table four is also not required. So only table one is required. Select the table and click load. So now Excel is just working on the data and see it has fetched all the data, whatever in the table, it is a simple task from 23rd June 2020 till 21st June 2021. So it's a very, very simple process which you can follow. So now, as I said earlier, now I have fetched the data. Now I'll show you how to use this data to forecast USD INR value for the next one month. So I'm leaving about what is the open, high, low volume and everything. I'm just going to use only these two columns. I'm selecting both the columns. Now again, I'm going to data tab and I'm using the option forecast. So once I click forecast, Excel will show 
a date forecast end up to 2022 but i don't want up to 2022 i am okay with forecast up to next one month which is 23rd july i have selected 23rd july and i am click trade so you can see these are the forecasted values see this is the column c is the forecast price which starts from 22nd june and the forecast is available up to 23rd july so this is the confidence layer lower and upper confidence level so this value is output of 95% confidence level so you can vary the confidence level also if you wish so that also i will show you how to do that in case if you want to vary the confidence level go back to forecast here you can change the confidence level whatever whether it can be 99% whether it needs to be 98% it's up to you and follow the same method and use the forecasted value anywhere you want to do hope you learned something new with this video and we will make many more videos please do subscribe and follow our channel and keep on learning with us thank you